Aaron, thank you. It is 650 today. You can relive some history at old Fort Niagara in Youngstown. It's the last reenactments of the siege of Fort Niagara, the largest event for the fort of the year. You can go back centuries ago and see historic battles and also see how some things were made. Seven News reporter Chrissy Williams there for us this morning. I have with me the executive director Robert Emerson here with me. Good morning. Thank you so much for being with us. So tell us a little bit about what's going to happen here today. Well, this is a reenactment of the siege of 1759. This two great empires were struggling for control of North America and Western New York was one of those battlegrounds. It was the French versus the British. The French came here and established the fort in 1726 and it controlled the Niagara Portage, which was the great water highway into the interior of North America. So the British wanted the French out of here. Mm. And uh, in July of 1759, they laid siege to the fort. Uh, took them about 19 days, but finally they forced the French to surrender. Uh, so this event this weekend, we do it annually and it recreates that historic event. Uh, I mean, we might be doing this interview in French today if things had gone differently. Mm, yeah, absolutely. So tell me what people can expect when they come and um, should they bring anything? How much do they have to pay to attend? Well, the um, admission is $21 per person. Um, you're going to see, uh, we have today we have two battle demonstrations. Um, we have uh, a whole lot of vendors and period artisans uh, demonstrating 18th century uh, crafts. Uh, we have um, uh, Native American Council that shows the diplomacy that went on behind the scenes to, to get the Native Americans to uh, side with the British uh, during this siege. Uh, we have a demonstration of, of nursing. I mean, how did they deal with the sick and the wounded at that time? Uh, and artillery firing demonstrations. So there's something going on all day long. Plus, there are a lot of uh, uh, a lot of programs that you can just walk around and see. Uh, there's a, a display of uh, Native American wampum, uh, cooking demonstrations, uh, blacksmithing. So there's just a, there's a lot going on. It's our biggest event of the year, uh, and we do it every July. Absolutely. So what is the last day of battle? I know that this is a weekend long event because the siege was going on for that long. Well, we uh, we only do it for three days instead of 19 days. And today is the final day of the program. It started on Saturday and uh, concludes today. And then tomorrow is July 4th and tomorrow's all American day here. We, we move from the French and Indian War to the War of 1812. Well, thank you so much for joining us. If you want to round out your July 4th weekend, you can find out how you can attend the reenactment over on WKBW.com. In Old Fort Niagara, I'm Kritzia Williams, 7 News.